Having crushed Greek resistance at Chironia, Philip installed himself as the head of the League of Corinth. This gave him control over all the armies of Greece, and he immediately set about his long-avowed desire to reclaim the Persian-ruled Greek cities in Asia Minor. In 337 BC, Philip sent an advanced invasion force under his most experienced general, Parmenian, across the Hellespont to establish a foothold in Asia Minor. But in 336 BC, Philip was suddenly assassinated and his young son Alexander had to move quickly to establish himself as undisputed king. Alexander immediately had all suspects executed and then marched to Greece where he summoned a meeting of the League of Corinth and forced the city-states to confirm him as rightful heir to Philip. He then quelled minor uprisings in Sparta and Athens before turning north to quash the unruly barbarian tribes. And when the city of Thebes rebelled, it soon learned what would become of those who dared defy Alexander. He razed the city to the ground and enslaved the entire population. For the time being, Greece was pacified, and Alexander turned his attention to the east and the Persian Empire. The advance force under Parmenian had been held up by the Greek mercenary leader, Memnon, who was fighting for the Persians. When Alexander arrived with an army of 40,000 men, he immediately confronted Memnon at the Granicus River. Welcome in to take six of what is proving to be a hot darn bloody hard battle right turn to game moving on uh we don't actually care about getting in position not properly because what i found is i actually did best when all the pikemen made it up here i don't know why but it seemed to just work better so we're gonna let it come let it happen and really what i think it comes down to is the ai pathfinding total war has never been the best and when it comes up to the edge of that water, it can't quite set up right. So we're going to try and take advantage of that. That said, we are going to get firing on some of this cavalry, just seeing if we can do a little bit of damage to it. Right, there we go. Everything sorted. Double speed. Um, in fact, you know what? We're going to set you up here because we're going to fire on these, these mercenaries. They don't have any shields. So hopefully we can do a little bit of damage on them. Cause some some morale penalties for the enemy. Claim this victory. It's much needed victory. It's, it's turning into one of them battles. Right, you don't fire at will. Get moving. We're going to control you. We have plans for you. I wonder if the AI would ever, like, get annoyed and just send their units at us. That would be kind of awesome. That would definitely make life a lot, lot easier against them. That's it. Come, come cross the fjord. You know you want to. Right, I think we're in. Let's get firing on some of these mercenary units. Hopefully we can just break a few of them. Improve, yeah, improve the percentage over here, get it nice and good. We slowly chip away. Really slowly chip away. Like, really slow. Oh my days. They are hitting them, right? Alright, flame. What? Seventy-nine, fifty-seven. Yeah, we're getting somewhere. How about if we fire on this one? Could you hit all of them? That could be cool. And that's basically all our ammunition gone. Right. Next up. Just grab two of them. And what we're going to try and do, if we can, is get across. Nice. Then we grab two of these. Uh, we'll grab three of them. Okay. Get them all moving over. Everything in position. We're going to need some cavalry on this flank. I think this is the last shot. 
coming in from our archers now. We've got a few. A few of them are burnt as well, so I'll be burning corpses to help us out. Right, we're gonna get charging in. Um, we're actually gonna set these guys up just there. Uh, they're gonna take a lot of damage, which is gonna suck. I'm hoping we can get the archers to come in and just beat them. Right, come on guys, Christian archers, make your way in. There they are. There's the enemy. Wanna have some fun? Right, let's get out of there. Chase! There we go. Come on guys. Keep those uh keep those horses coming. Right into phalangelists. Yep, there we are. We should be having some shots coming in from the missiles as well, but they, they don't seem to really want to do anything. Right, let's get the second unit now pushing forward. It's coming along, right? That'll be the first unit dealt with. Uh, <laughs> we're actually dragging the Persian Peltus. A welcome surprise. Yep, first unit absolutely rinsed and riddled. Getting rid of that cavalry on the fjord is uh, surprisingly difficult. Not gonna deny. Right, let's get the infantry shuffling over to take this on. Yeah, that's a lot of prehensiles and shots coming in on them. Alright, take you off, fire at will. Oh my days, they got absolutely destroyed! Ooh, are they gonna come over this side? We can live with that. Heck yeah. Right, in that case, let's get the archers ready. I think... I think they're gonna come over. Hello. Oh no. No, what? What, a, what are you doing? What's that? Heavy cav, heavy cav, and another unit of peltis have come over. They've actually abandoned the center. I reckon we can take a little bit of an advantage of that? I think we can. Go on, let's get you guys ready. Say hello to our not-so-little friends. Yeah, let's reset you. And let's go see if we can start dragging this unit over, maybe. Just give him a, a hello with the old spear. Javelin to the face. Because there is... There's only one unit. So that's one, two, three, four, five. They're getting shot. That ain't good. There's only five. Ooh. Well, what are you guys going to do? Big throws. You there. Publius. Throw your mighty stick. Nice. Ish. Ah, there's the other. Okay, they ran off into the trees. Well, with that, we can definitely make it in. And we can also get all of these guys running. We're going to use archers, I think, as a bit of a shield. You guys, pull away. Pull away. You've done your job. You've confused the enemy. And let's get them crossing over. And we got all this delicious cavalry ready to go. Soon, my precious. Right, was 8% to 13. Doing good. Alright, you guys actually should just run. You should just run. Because you're getting shot by a lot of... Yeah, I think it's all their cavalry. All the Scythians. Uh, it's going to be a little bit messy just why they get in and set up. But once they do, we're ready to start pushing. This is the hardest part. If you can't get across the fjord and actually set your soldiers up, you get rinsed so quickly. 
Right, yeah, they're, they're doing their job. They're firing away at us. That's, that's acceptable. It's not nice, but it is acceptable. Could you go fire at those peltists? Yeah, okay. That'll do. All right, let's get you guys running. Oh, <laughs> they just obliterate our missiles. Okay. Yep. Farewell, javelin man. All right, you guys can all fire away. Fire will. All right, you're all in. Excellent. Phalanx. Let's see you guys shuffling up. Bring a nice wall of pikes. Everyone likes a nice wall of pikes. Right, that infantry's done its job. Let's see if we can get all of these a lot of units uh, coming over onto that flank so we've, we've made the breach head yeah some nice prehensiles into them unfortunately they do seem to have a decent amount of armor to them despite like visually not having any i don't really get what that is about but they really do seem to be able to, to hold their own in that regard. Uh, I don't really want you, but I do want a unit of cav charging them in the back. Yep, you're doing good. Let's go send another unit over there to help them. Got some good throws. Yeah, they were okay. All right, we don't mind staring down the rest of them. That's perfectly fine. You guys should have your pikes down. Even though you don't seem to be capable of that. Right, there we go. Sorted. Moving on. On to the next target. Right, let's see if we can get these... Coming on over. Let's see if we can catch some of these out as well. Right, we're going to bring our general out and around um, to avoid the Persian enemy general. That's something we don't want to hit. And um, we're going to go crack these guys in the back as well because uh, we're here. We have the option. Right, we can actually get in and snipe their general while we're here as well. Oh, Macedonians are breaking. Why are you breaking, Macedonians? Right, General Alexander, give us a nice cheer and remind the soldiers who they are. Right, everyone in aisle. Enemy general. Enemy general. Get them get them destroyed. Oh yeah, that's a that's a massacre. The enemy general flees. Right, I'm gonna go Press break this so unit. I think. I hope. I hope Alexander will be enough. For some reason, we've lost the ability to do his special, which has me ever so slightly scared. Because doesn't that mean the general's gone? The gods be praised. The enemy general is dead. His men know their doom approaches. Good for them. Right, let's get some. No, nope, we don't even need the assist. Let's get a setup here. And just... Oh, they're down to one. Don't worry about it. I was going to say get them a bit of a chase down. All right, let's grab those two. Go smash some Peltis. Finally, we're in position. And it looks like the AI is just letting us have it. So uh, let's let's not question that. <laughs> let's not question that at all. Excellent. Right, you go smash them. There's like 13 left. All of those units have run away. Excellent. So... What do we have to deal with? We have some Scythian horsemen. We have Bactrian and Cav. I think another unit of not Scythian in there, sorry. And then just loads of those spears. Oh, hello. All right, we're going to spread you guys out. We're going to go for a bit of a surrounding 
They're gonna charge us. Right, we flank them. Yeah, that should be enough. Beautiful. Ooh, nice. Um, let's send our general to help out, just clearing them out. We should be able to, to catch them from behind. Get one unit. Keep it with us. Always need a little bit of cavalry. All right, let's get three set up. Two, just to protect the flank. We need to create a bit of an overlap. All right, put them on run away because we do want we want some units who can run away. Down to 15. That'll have to do. Come back, General. We'll need you. Right, who's alive? <laughs> Who is left of this enemy? Um, do you even know where to... Yeah. Do they even know where they're going? Right, when you come up on that flank, they're going to be charging things in the back. Big throws. Tasty. Right, I'm gonna get them moving in now, because it looks like they are just gonna basically come straight into these flangelists, and I'm perfectly happy with that. Right, the last two flangelists we're just gonna set up behind, giving ourselves some protection, some options. We got all this cavalry. Hello. Oh, mass break. That makes your heart good. Right, let's reset. And I think, yeah, we're just going to send our cabin to mop all this up. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. Actually, you know what? Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep it going. Big mass, mass break. All infantry moving forward. Cavalry coming up behind. I think we can get another, we can get another chuck in there. Let's get this cavalry coming in, hitting that flank. Big old prehensiles. Right, now the charge. We get some spears in. Ooh, don't even need it. Alright, keep charging through into the Scythians. Oh my god, they've gone so far ahead. We, we need to speed up. We need to try and get these units in. Right, get them running down. Chuck's in the side. Did our did our cavalry survive? Oh my days, it survived. Excellent. Oh, we got this. Right. Phalanx. Phalanx. Uh, phalanx here well. Ooh. The enemy army is in flight. Pursue them. Drive them from the battlefield. Well, that went way better than it did before. It kind of seems like the trick is just wait and get over that beachhead the ai is not massively aggressive they're not going to push you out so you, you've got the time you've got the time to do it and use it but after that excellent go on we're all ready for the next one ready to enjoy the next of the war on sunday but if you have enjoyed this one please do hit that like button it actually really helps the channel and if you want to see more or more importantly if you want other people to see more do hit subscribe as well until then as always lords and ladies peace out